Hello everyone, this is Ian Hua. I'm present you the study effects of particle size in metal nano ink for electrohydrodynamic ink jet printing through analysis of droplet impact behaviors. Let's get started. For introduction, the electrohydrodynamic ink jet printing, also called e jet printing, provides fine resolution for parts that used metallic nano ink. Printing results can be affected by both printing parameters as well as the material properties of the ink fluid. Particle size of the nano fluid used in the ink's formulation significantly affects droplet behaviors when droplet ejects away from the nano as well as the droplet hits the substrates. High-speed cameras can capture images fast enough for fluid dynamics analysis. Machine vision approach utilizes MATLAB programming to analysis droplet deposition activities such as the contact angle, droplet heights, and droplet width. The objective are first we formulate eject printable inks that can be formulated and used in eject printing process. Perform droplet experiments with and without electrical field present between the printing nozzle and substrate. Capture the images using high speed cameras. Design and optimize MATLAB code to analysis high speed captured images for droplet impact speed, diameter change, height change, and contact angle changes. For materials, we're using constant nanoparticles. Separated them into three different sizes by centrifugation. Dissolve polyvinyl polyden, short for PVP, to cancel for molecular weight into TGME as working solution. Mix them one to one ratio to form the final ink solution. Generate ink droplets using 21 gauge nozzle by hydraulic pressure. For the electric case, we also apply the different voltages to mimic different electrical force. Capture images at 8,500 frames per second using high-speed cameras. Extract droplet impact behaviors, speed, impact speed, diameter change, height change, and contact angle change information using modified MATLAB code. By analyzing those results, we find the diameter change percentage of the droplet in behaves differently with and without the electro field present, as well as the impact velocity. As you can see in the graph, with the electricity present, the velocity increasing significantly. We have time period of phase two and phase three have different time frame when with and without the electric field. By far, we thank Integrat Research Assistant Program for IMSE Department 3M Non-Tenure Factor Reward. We also thank Dr. Fei Liu and Mr. Xiao Zhang for advising the ink preparation and printing. By looking to the study, we published a journal article in Journal of Manufacturing Process. Thanks for listening. Wish you have a wonderful day.